Hey guys, welcome back to Battle for Wesnoth. So I must have been very confused, because I thought I'd ended this level, but apparently... Apparently there's more to this. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a mess. So hopefully we'll run up here and end this. I can't... This is three, uh, three videos just for this one episode. Or this one, uh, scenario, I should say. So, I don't know. I thought that the scenario ended. I'm assuming I run up here and we'll find out. I don't want to rush it too far ahead, though, because you never know. You never know. Maybe they'll try something sneaky. Now we can do this. Go for it. Oh, yeah, there's more bad guys. I can't believe I didn't see this. I see them. There they are. Curses. If they had been an hour slower, our master's reinforcements would already be here to meet us. Kill the Dark Adept before his reinforcements arrive. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this is where I, I should have hung back. Because now i got to rush all these guys up. Wow, I really blew this. My bad, guys. What a scrub thing to do. I'm just going to rush this guy up, even though he'll probably never get there. Hopefully our cavalry can close the ground. Get some healing... All right, all right. So we got, what is this guy, a revenant? He's undead and has an axe. Dear Lord, I wonder how much time I have. I'm assuming the nine turns, which I'm thinking should be enough, but I don't know. I need to leave the cavalry back a little bit, let them heal. Arbeth comes up, gets self-replicating up there. This would be unfortunate. What if I lost after all that? I can't believe it. That would be so unfortunate. They have this very, uh, very nasty the way this is blocked off. Like, two cavalry would be able to kill them, but, uh, or kill this dark adept guy, but he's in the trees, so that's scary. Cavalry not doing so well in the trees. Let's go and bring him up a little bit. Man, I can't believe I didn't see that. Nobody said anything either. Come on, guys. Pick me up here. You know? Whoops, that was a miss. That works. That's where I wanted him. And we'll just run him up there. My guy needs two more experience, I think. He does. For for an upgrade. Oh! Survive it. Good lord almighty. Oh! Oh, wow, that was so close. Eh, he's not very good anyway. Pull him back. I think I'm going to go right for the kill on this. Because I, uh... Like I said, I'm assuming I have till 24 turns, but... I'd rather not risk it. And I'm going to get my guy some experience here, so... A little bit of favoritism. Oh my god, I didn't... Sp I thought he might miss one. Ha! You've captured me, but it will avail you nothing. I sent your precious brother the mage north with half my men a day since. If he's safely locked away in our master's dungeons by now. My blade is at your throat. Give us the way to my brother now, or I will spill your wretched blood on the ground. Three days' ride to the northeast, in a deserted castle. The passwords to the guards are Leban and Zaskanat. Well, that was easy. Bind him and take him with us. If he has played us false, he will die. Captain. What are we riding into? I thought you wanted nothing to do with Baran anymore. Not since Torn Karak. I'm not sure. What's between us remains, but knowing someone else has laying hands on him changes things. Mount up, and let's get moving. Okay, I got an upgrade here. So we got two units. We got the Knight and the Lancer. Okay, so the Knight's got a 14 damage, 2 attack Lance, and a 8 damage, 4 attack sword. No other abilities or anything like that. Lancer appears to just have the lance. 12 damage, 3 attacks. I like the knight myself. Because we don't have many swords in our army. We have a lot of piercing though. I can't believe I blew that, guys. I'm, I'm, I'm shocked. Excerpt from the Journal of Rotheric the Clanless. 
The last of Mordok's servants arrived this morning bearing the news of his death, as well as a bundle so well bound it was barely recognizable as a man. Mordok was always reckless. This whole desperate scheme was his, and I suppose I could blame him for everything that we have suffered through it. Uh, still mattered. It was he who brought the wrath of the orcs down on us, too. But all the same, he managed to accomplish what he set out to do. I still cannot believe the finality of what, was, what has happened. Until now, we had always managed to make it through somehow. We had hoped to deliver the mage to Tyrock in return for our lives. I do not know what the warlord wants with this man, but he matches the description. I suppose that Mordok's plan would have worked perfectly if not for the appearance of the horse warriors. Now they are coming here, led by a man rumored to be his mage's brother. If that is true, he will stop at nothing, no more than I would if they held Mordok. I have done what I can to fortify this dilapidated castle. The orcs who came with us stand guard at the gates, and I am gathering all of my servants to me in the inner sanctum. But, I'll w but ill fate awaits. Whether I defeat this horse warrior or no, the orcs will still come for me. They have been scouring the borderlands and raiding the northern farm country in search of us. Yet for some reason I fear these brothers more. If Mordok were here, it would be different, but we are broken, and these two men are whole. In each other, in the ties that bind them, they have strength. Okay. Heading over to the uh, Griffin Mountains, it appears. Arvith and his men halt outside of the castle, gazing for a moment at the hulking mass of stone looming in the fog. There is movement in the mist. Halt. Friend or foe, give the password. Oh, shit. He goes 11. Pass, friend. The adept didn't lead us astray after all. I'll keep my word. Distra distasteful as it may be, cut him loose. And let's be rid of him. Alright, we got a rescue Baran in this one. Okay, cool. I would like to get a, a, like a wizard in this. Look how big our castle area is. So we can recruit just a crap ton of units. And, um, let's take a look at the map. It's much wider than the last one. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And a lot of fog of war. Whoa. Total of seven. I guess it only shows the seven we can see. It's a zero out of seven. Okay. So let's get to bringing our guys back. Ooh, and I got a... Oh, no, I can't remember. I can't remember. I looked it up. We're going to rename this guy. Okay, there it is, guys. Sultanu. I could not remember it. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. That's our swordsman. And let's check and see who else. Obviously, we got to get my guy back. But let's put mine towards the back, just because he's cavalry and can kind of cover the ground quickly. Boom. And obviously, we need self-replicating whatnot. 174 gold. All of our men are experienced now. So, like, except for these two down here. Like, all four of these, I think, are worth picking up. At the very least. Uh, cavalry. Put them in the back again. We need more bowmen. And I would like to get one of these foot pads upgraded. Well, let's go ahead and get this one back. We're going to take them all. Screw it. Okay. And then, what are we at? We're at... We're at, uh... Negative one? I always forget how this reads. Upkeep. See, it looks like negative three to me right now. So, we'll wait, a, we'll wait a turn before we bring out the next guy. Didn't start with anyone, so no can move. How many turns? We've got 24. Run the footpad over there. Cavalry. Ah, I probably should have put the cavalry up front. Because I could have grabbed this on turn one. That was a bad call on my part. Bad call. Okay. There's a fort right there. So probably enemies. We have no bowmen upgraded. So I definitely want to get a couple more bowmen out. Okay. Oh, wow, they just appeared. Are you a relief arriving? Does this mean we get to leave here now? Um, yes. Fine, you can go. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Um, you're supposed to give the password. Zaskanat. Thanks. Irritating little formality, isn't it? 
I think I should better support my men at the front to make sure we can free my brother. Okay. I would like to get a little bit of scouting in here. So let's run this guy up and see what... Ah, oh, nice. Okay. I'm thinking this ridge is probably going to block our movement. I'm assuming. I don't think we've seen anything like that just yet. So that's something to consider. This is risky, but I'm going. Ha <laughs> ha! We not kill people for a long time. Weapon wants blood. We now kill humans. My sword arm has a say in who will do the dying. Come on, men. Let's kill some orcs. Okay, that's good. It does stop you when you spot stuff. So we got... Uh, there's that boss guy and this castle guard. Oh, man. Sam T was talking about their assassin units. They are really mean. So hopefully we don't have to fight them this level. Or else we might have casualties. Let's see. Let's get our bowmen out. And I think another footpad's not a bad idea either because they have that great defense even in the open field. In the turn. All right. Snag this up. I'm wondering if we can go through here. I think I'm going to have to run up there and check it out. Or maybe even through this area. Yeah, we're going to have to rush all the way over here. Grab all these, though. And I think that orcs are good in hills. So we got to watch out for these spots. Two enemies sighted? Really? Oh, wow. Two more up there. Holy moly. We got to drag them out. I'm really feeling like I should be looking at... Like, this looks bad to go into here. I don't know. We're going to find out. See what other vision we can get over here. Next. Okay. These fat footpads are so fast. It's not a nice thing about them, I would say. Should Arvith come out? We have a lot of units going in. Yeah, I think I'm going to bring him. We're all spread out. Okay, they're moving for us. I was wondering if they were just going to hang back. Oh my god. Hmm. Oh, he attacked... He attacked self-replicating in the open rather than... Well, yeah, that was probably easier hit for him. So that makes sense. That's the boss guy. He basically killed himself. He's an orcish warrior. Unit description... He's got a great sword, no ranged attack, no uh, negative resistances. Yeah, they're good in mountains, 60% defense. That's what I was thinking. But these are hills, aren't they? So what's the hill stat? 50%, okay. So I think we should just uh, pelt this guy with arrows and stuff. Pew! 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 Oh my god, work him. I really want to get... some new upgrades. Oops. So we got this cavalry here. He would probably come really close. Can't reach him, though. Yeah, and he's got to get this village, so... We'll hold him back. My guy's already upgraded, so I don't want to really use him just yet. Castle Guard. I f I'm worried about going too far up here. Like, they're going to come down and, and crush me. But, let's see. 50% chance. So, we're looking at... He's going to do 8 or 16 damage to me. That's pretty uh, dangerous. And he's pretty high in experience. So, I don't want to put him in that kind of position. So, let's go here. We'll throw the javelin. Actually, we might be able to kill this one, though. Yeah, let's try to kill this guy first. Nice. One less braggart orc in the world. Captain, what are orcs doing this far south? Good question. Perhaps my brother will have found out. Alright, I'm going to keep sending this guy up because I'm really curious. And it looks like definitely no... No dicer going around there from the looks of it. Okay. Wow, I don't like that chance at all. Uh, but he would only do 18 max. Doesn't seem like anything else will be able to reach him. So, Sultano, 
Go for it, baby. Uh. Uh. Oh for four. Oh no. <laughs> That's not good. Okay. Oh, I, oh damn, I almost I almost sent him in there. I was thinking he had a magic attack, because I've been playing the um Elvish campaign a little bit. Alright, let's try this. So we got a little sight now. Surprised that that would give me sight from out there. I don't want to risk this guy. That guy's already used up. That guy's already used up. And self-replicating. I would like to get a little healing. 29 is a little too low for me, I think. He can't reach, though. Uh, huh. Well, crap. Alright, we'll go ahead and grab this. I'm not too worried about just one orc at this point. 35 damage. I don't like it. Just because if I get a real bad roll, I, he could get killed next turn, so. <gasps> Forgot about this guy. That a boy? Oh! Dang, two hits. It's unfortunate. Unfortunate. Yeah, these uh, skeletons were definitely going to want the foot pads around for those. Because they are weak to the blunt attacks. This guy's a little beat up. Oh, and this is where the javelin's going to shine on these, on these ghost characters. That's definitely solid because they... Uh, they uh, heal whenever they hit you with their melee attack. I want to move this guy off the village so I can put self-replicating there. So I'm going to move him up here and go ahead and chuck this baby. Boom. And... For the kill. Nice. Good stuff. Alright, now we got... Some stuff to work with on these orcish warriors. I would prefer that they be on open ground, but we don't have that option right now. Sultanu, I got faith in you, buddy. 0 for 6. There it is. Okay. Wow, one hit out of 7. That's some really bad luck. Really bad luck. Do we want to go for this now? One hit will kill. I like it. Got it. Atta, baby. Okay, and I think these are good on the hills as well. Let's just check. 50% also. And then on open terrain, 40%. So ideally we would fight on flat, but it's probably not going to happen because there's a lot of hills here. Let's go and grab this. And then my guy can come back. It's going to be interesting to see how this works out. Let's see. They can hit me. They can come after my guy twice there, but I should be okay. I hope. Ah, oh, boy. Who else do we got? I assume I can't shoot from here, right? Oh, I can. We have 60% defense in there, too. So actually... We'd definitely want to get up there. Alright, let's go ahead and move everybody up. This guy, Sultano needs a little healing. Oops. See, like, I could go here. Even right here, though, I'd be looking at four attacks. So who could go up with him is the question. Just that one guy. I, I don't like that. If I could get two up there to kind of create some space, I'd be up for it. Oh my god, a skeleton chopping wood. We got one of those adepts coming. Survive it, baby. Ugh. Nice, nice. Definitely don't want to lose him. He's got 24 experience. All my guys have pretty decent experience now, so that's kind of... Kind of unfortunate in a way, because I, I feel like I don't have anyone to risk. Let's see if... Boy, I wish I had more blunt attacks.
My guy's not terrible against him. Not, not great either. Let's get this guy moving back. I'll forget about him over here. Okay, well, I think what I'm going to do is try to get this guy with the bows. Ah, oh, that's big. Okay, nice. Nice. I wasn't expecting that, but it worked out. And this archer has no melee weapon, so definitely prefer to attack in melee against him. Wow, 70% defense up here. Look at that. That ain't bad. Could almost probably... Yeah, I could kill this guy in one shot. So we can let him come forward one more turn. And then charge him and kill him, probably. Let's go ahead and move in here. Start working on these skeletons. Damn. Two hits. No bueno. Now this guy does not have a bow, right? But we're going to do crap damage against him, unfortunately. How do we want to do this? I think I'll be safe. Can do 22 here, we'll get a 20. I like the I like the four attacks better. Not to mention Wow, he would do almost double damage if I chose the the charge option, which is kind of odd. Okay. Let's go for it. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Okay, not bad. These skeletons really worry me. Stick with the melee against this one. Oh no, I forgot! <gasps> no, I forgot he was wounded! Damn it! Son of a bitch. Ah, oh, I can't believe I did that. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay. Mistakes have been made. Mistakes have been made. Pretty good, pretty good. So now the question is, do we go for this kill? Oh, I'm really upset I did that, guys. I, that was stupid. That was stupid. Okay, yeah, let's let's go for the kill on this archer. First and foremost, get him out of the way. Ah, oh, self-replicating failed me. Hmm. Arvith. I think... I think we can weather an attack. Ah, I don't like it. If I put him here... Yeah, he would have this Adept attacking him, this guy attacking him, this guy. Yeah, we can't do that. It's too risky. That's unfortunate. Okay. Oh boy, they're going for me. Oh boy, they're going for me, guys. Oh, here comes the poison. Son of a gun. Okay, I can't remember if I've said it before, but poison does 8 damage every turn. Oh, no. And then, um... If you're standing in a village, you don't take the... You don't take the poison damage. It just kind of sits until it heals. This is unfortunate, though. Sling. Yeah, we want to go with that. Oh, my guy's messed up. He's messed up, guys. It's not good. Need to pull back. So we can kill this guy for sure. But we definitely want to kill this Adept. So we got self-replicating. A little wounded. With free attacks. So let's do it. Oh no. Oh no. What about Arvith? Ah, I can't reach. Oh no. Okay, if I kill this guy here... Yeah, yeah, we got two shots now. Only one experience on this bowman, so he's... It's okay to risk him, I think. But, we're not gonna be able to kill him with our melee attack. Shnikes. I'm surprised he can't reach here. Oh man, it's bad. Alright, what can this guy do then? We can go for a lance charge on this ghoul. Which I think is not a bad idea. Or we could try to hit this guy for up to 42 damage. 
which would be better. But God, he could hit me for 36. <laughs> oh, I think I like this one better. We're going for it. Come on, baby. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. Let's go ahead and shoot him. No point in attacking the Adept, I don't think, with the Bowman. Because I couldn't kill him. Couldn't do enough melee damage. And, uh, you know. The range attack would have been a really bad idea there. Hmm. If I go here and attack... No, I could take two hits from these two. I, I don't think I like that. In fact, I'm going to pull him further back. I already lost, what, two units? And then I think... Two, I think they were both pretty good in terms of upgrades or at least experience that they had. Survive it, baby. Oh, God. Okay, these bats have huge movement range. Not much damage, though. So we got Arvith, who can get there. We should be able to kill all three of these, I think, this turn. And I would rather... Hmm. Let's see. Okay, Sultanu's healed enough, so he can go back up. But he can't reach anything, so it doesn't really matter. I think we just gotta let's just let's just play it safe and kill this guy. There we go. Okay. And then self-replicating, chucks his spears, kills this guy. That a baby. Okay, this guy will hold off there for a second. My guy should be able to clean this up, but let's see if anyone else can get there. Seven and two. And he can't reach, so I'll go ahead and try to kill him with mine. Ooh, that's uh <laughs> not very good chances. Oh, that's Han, actually. Hmm. Okay, he got one in. That's big. Sling is only doing seven damage. Might not be able to get this. Yeah, we're probably not gonna, oh, probably not gonna get him. Might as well try, though. Pretty slim chances. Yeah. Okay, we gotta watch out for this one here. He's pretty well blocked off, though, as you can see, so we can just heal him up. And our foot pad's a little damaged, so I'm gonna move the bowman over here just to block any units that come down. Actually, we can go up to this spot and get a 60% uh, defense, so... Let's go ahead and do that. 70 for the foot pad. That's, that's pretty damn solid. Okay, Sultanu comes up. My guy moves in for healing. That looks good. I'm really hoping that somewhere to the north I can... Uh, I can recruit some more units. Oh my god! Dang! No. Okay, we need to pepper that guy with arrows and all kinds of stuff. We need to get rid of this bat. Nice. Can Arvith charge from here? He can. That's 28 damage on the charge. That's pretty good. My guy can't quite reach, unfortunately. So, we're looking at... Wow. I'm a little worried, guys. I feel like I'm losing more than I... I would like to see. I would like to get this guy out of the way, and then I can basically surround this guardsman. We're on 10 turn... or 10th turn. 60% chance to hit. Oh, boy. <laughs> Three attacks. <laughs> I'm going for it. Balls out, baby. Balls to the wall. Dodge it. Duck. Oh, okay. Three hit points. Let's see if we can get this. Gah, you're killing me. I would like to get some experience for our foot pads. Uh. 
Sultanu going in. Damn. Struggling. Sultanu is struggling. But he got the job done. We are a wreck. I don't know if we're going to make it. I wish I had someone back there to be able to recruit units. Arvith got jacked up. Oh, man. These guys need healing. Okay. We're alright. We are okay. Oh, yes. I don't like this. That they can counter my sling with these types of skeletons. Let's try the club. Another skeleton up there. I'll tell you what, that strong trait I think is huge. This guy's strong, doing 10 damage as opposed to this one's 8. That's pretty, pretty big difference when you factor it in over the course of an entire battle. I think the way to go here would be to uh, run the cavalry around the sides, like, like so. Picking up another ghoul over there. Dear lord. These need to heal a little bit longer. Oh man. I don't know if we're going to make it. I don't know if we're going to make it, but... We're doing our best. Okay. Gotta rush these up. Gonna need everybody. I really hate that, how the camera pans down. Oh my god, good work. The foot pads. Getting work done. So he doesn't do very good damage against our swordsmen. That's pretty awesome. I'm really liking the swordsmen, actually. I, I think I uh, over or underestimated them. Can't quite get two men in there, unfortunately. Okay, self-replicating. Can't quite kill him, but get in there. Arvith, take a look-see. What's my objective in this? I already forgot. Rescue Baron, okay. I hope Baron doesn't, like, turn on us. I'm getting this bad feeling. Oh my god. Okay, I really don't like seeing this on self-replicating, so he's definitely getting pulled out. That's uh, very scary. Very scary. Ideally, what we would see is a chance to kill this guy in one shot after doing some kind of range damage to him. Question is whether we're going to be able to get in there or not. Ah... We're going for it. Oh my god, you're killing me. Oh no. Uh, so bad. Okay. Well, we got a chance for the charge. Oh my god. The numbers, guys, they hate me. Attaboy, Arvith. Oh wow, Arvith getting an upgrade. Interesting. He's got a heal option under the Paladin. Five attacks with the sword and two attacks with the lance. Or 12 by 4 attacks with the sword on the Grand Knight. This is pretty cool. I think I gotta go for the healing. That's, that's hard to beat. We don't have any healing in our army, and I believe that we could heal Self-Replicating's poison now. So that's what we're going with. I'm going to keep this knight back, because I feel like if I run up here and spot somebody... Well, I don't know. They might move through the Fog of War anyway. I don't like my archer's chances here either. That was really unfortunate. Okay, we're going for it. Oh, he ran. That's good. This is good for us. Go for the kill, baby. Nice. Oh, God, double poison. Okay, I'm going to try this. I'm going to move him here. I think that that will prevent... Prevent them from taking damage from the poison, and it might even heal them, I think. Two enemies. We got Rotharic and Owaydok up there. 
Alright, I'm gonna play it very safe with him, but now that we have the healer, we have options. In fact, I don't know if it's everybody adjacent to him, but I'm gonna keep as many next to the paladin as I can. I think it heals everybody around. Yeah, yeah, okay, good stuff. We definitely want a position to take advantage of this. So let's go ahead, we'll put him here. Let's see, him here. I'm I'm almost certain we can heal the poison here. If I can't, then I'm gonna be in trouble because we only have nine turns left. Okay, I got faith. Ah, oh, damn. Not much damage from this guy, but I'm throwing everything I can right now. Get worked, ally guy. Our dude did not do well there. Okay, what kind of range does he have? So he can't reach us yet. I'm not too worried about these adepts, because we have such good cavalry right now. Oh! Oh, God. That would have been upsetting. It doesn't seem like the poison's healing, which is not good. And I gotta move. I gotta kill I gotta kill these guys before they get in here. So let's see. We're gonna go like this. Good work, that baby. I don't like that because of the resistance. Oh no, he blocked this. Right. Didn't think about that. It would take two charge hits. At 60% to kill him. Or we can go with Sultanu. And it would take all four hits. Ugh. Dang. What about my guy? Don't like that any better. Hmm. Scrim. Scrim. Okay, let's go here. I really need to kill this, this skeleton. That's pretty big. <laughs> oh, the numbers are in my favor. Yes! Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Okay, what we're gonna do... We're, gonna, we're just gonna shuffle. Kinda like that. I think we should be able to handle that. He comes in, hits one of us. Probably Sultanu. We don't get it a counter, but we'll be okay. Yep. Oh, jeez. That, that worried me when I saw the ghoul coming in, too. Alright, 37 on the charge. That's pretty monster damage. I think what I need to do is get in here and, and basically assassinate this mage guy with our... with our cavalry. And I'm gonna try to scout back here. Oh, where is he? I don't see him. Oh, look! We got a, um... Got a new character. I guess they only have one uh, upgrade path, so... Seda the Outlaw. Strong, quick. Still mace and uh, sling damage. Cool. Okay, my guy gonna go in. Okay, he did good damage. Poisoned. Half my army's poisoned right now. Good thing we have the... Good thing we have the healer now. That... That was a big pickup. I have seven turns to make this happen. Did he not attack at all? That's that's interesting and scary at the same time. He's got 48 hit points. Oh god. I wish this poison wasn't wasn't hitting me so hard. I what I want to do is run my cavalry around. And just charge this guy. So, let's see. I'm going to go in. I'm going to hit this guy. Oh, jeez. Never mind. We'll use a sling. Oh, boy. Way to be worthless. Okay, this guy's a little wounded, and he's really close to upgrading. So, we don't want to get him too, too much danger. 
Who can kill this ghoul for us? <laughs> Reliably. I think it's this one. Ah, that's that's it. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, he upgraded. There we go. We got a long man now. A long bowman, I mean. Sorry. 12 damage, 3 shots. That's pretty solid. Okay. Really want to keep these guys as close as possible. I think we can get in there. Oh. Damn. This is unfortunate, because they put a unit here, so I won't be able to charge around with my cavalry and get into that spot. But I think we can do this just between Arvith and my guy. Though I, I would really hate to try to do it with my guy, just because he's uh, kind of jacked up. Oh, God. 18 hit points. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Your hand of Tyrock's death is still death. Tyrock? Who is, or what is Tyrock? There's a key in his robes. Ha, I had a line, guys. That may well be the key to the cell they're holding Baran in. I'll take it. Move Arvid to the cell with his brother to free him. Oh my god, where is he at? Okay, keeping these guys. I'm a little, now I'm really worried about our, our guys over here. I really am. This guy's got a sword now. That's pretty damn cool. These guys are interesting because when you, they kill a unit, they the the unit turns against your army. They come back to life. I think that what I'm going to do is I'm just going to try to bottleneck them while we run over. And I'm just going to kind of hope that uh, Baron's on the right. Because <laughs> I'm really feeling pressured. Oh, they gave us more time though. We have all the way to turn 30 now. Dude, these outlaws, man, are just beasts. Oh, way to go, uh, longbowmen. Way to be kind of worthless. I don't like that. It's too far. Why can't I go back? I want to undo that. It won't let me. What is this? So he doesn't seem like he's on this side, which is bad. It's very scary for me. I got faith that our outlaw can block that, though. I really wish this didn't happen. I, I would like to take that move back. Oh, God. Oh, between self-replicating and Sultanu being really messed up, I'm very concerned. I may have made a, a very big mistake. Look at this monster of an outlaw, though. Holy, holy moly. Oh, so bad. Mm. Seven and uh, we might be able to kill this ghoul, which would be big. And this skeleton's only got five hit points. So again, we should be able to kill him too. Okay, so let's go for the double kill. Nice. Big. Big time in it. Can he pull it off? Doesn't look like it. It's gotta be cavalry. Okay. We're hanging in, guys. It's not pretty right now. <laughs> it's really not pretty. Let's see. This guy, as long as he can't get back here, we're okay, though. Just keep these back. Alright, everybody's just getting poisoned like crazy. Oh my god, what a monster. Who wants this guy? Who wants to be Seda? What a beast. And, okay. Dude, that guy's a monster. Okay, we, let's get going. Everybody 
dying of poison. It's like the plague. Survive it. I don't even know why I'm bringing units over here, because at this point... Uh, it's pretty much Arvith. Going on his own. Oh, there's a cell right there. Is this him? Oh, I missed it. I missed the, the damn uh, line there. And you too, brother. The accursed dark sorcerer Rotharic has prisoned me behind this magically enhanced iron gate. It can only be opened with the correct key. You must get it from him to free me. Oh, I got it. I murdered that dude already. I have a bad feeling about this gate right here. And whether or not there's going to be an enemy unit coming out of it. Half our army is... Well, more than half of our army is one shot from dying. Can't see in there. Oh, man. Thank you for saving me. I was not certain you would come. Have you no faith in your brother, Bron? It's not that. Perhaps I deserve to rot here. I failed you. I failed you again. That is as... as ah, that is as may be, but you are my brother still. And I never doubted you would have come for me. It was no great trial, after all. A few elves, one or two dark sorcerers, a gang of orcs, and some undead. Really just a day's work for the company. Thank you for coming to my aid. Let us return to the village. Woo! Okay. Lost a couple good units, but all in all, we're intact. I got some upgrades. Pretty excited about those. This freaking outlaw is awesome. Uh, Cavalry's doing pretty well, I think. We got the Paladin guy. I'm hoping to see Barad in the next episode, next scenario, which I think is the last one. And that's going to do it for Battle for Wesnoff today. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you in the next episode.